Chapter 8. Now Benjamin begat Bela his firstborn, Ashbel the second, and Ahera the third, Nohah the fourth, and Repha the fifth. And the sons of Bela were Adar, and Gera, and Abihud, and Abishua, and Naaman, and Ahoa, and Gera, and Shephuphan, and Huram. And these are the sons of Ehud. These are the heads of the fathers of the inhabitants of Geba, and they removed them to Manahath. And Naaman and Ahiah and Gera, he removed them and begat Uzzah and Ahihud. And Shehareim begat children in the country of Moab after he had sent them away. Hushim and Beera were his wives. And he begat of Hodesh his wife, Jobab and Zibia and Mesha and Malcolm and Zeaz and Shekiah and Murma. These were his sons, heads of the fathers. And of Hushim he begat Abitab and Elpeo. The sons of Elpeel, Eber and Misham and Shamed, who built Ono and Lod with the towns thereof, Beriah also and Shema, who were heads of the fathers of the inhabitants of Ijalon, who drove away the inhabitants of Gath, and Ahio, Sheshak and Jeremoth, and Zebadiah and Arad and Ada, and Michael and Ispa and Joha, the sons of Beriah and Zebadiah, and Meshullam, and Hezekai, and Heber, Ishmerai also, and Jezliah, and Jobab, the sons of Elpeo. And Jacob, and Zikri, and Zabdi, and Elienai, and Zilthi, and Eliel, and Adiah, and Beriah, and Shimrath, the sons of Shimhai. And Ishpan, and Heber, and Eliel, and Abdon, and Zikri, and Hanan, and Hananiah, and Elam, and Antothijah, and Iphediah and Penuel, the sons of Sheshach, and Shamsherai, and Shehariah, and Athaliah, and Jerusiah, and Eliah, and Zikri, the sons of Jeroham. These were heads of the fathers by their generations, chief men. These dwelt in Jerusalem. And at Gibeon dwelt the father of Gibeon, whose wife's name was Maacah, and her firstborn son, Abdon, and Zer, and Kish, and Baal, and Nadab, and Gedor, and Ahio, and Zacher. And Mikloth begat Shimea. And these also dwelt with their brethren in Jerusalem over against them. And Ner begat Kish, and Kish begat Saul, and Saul begat Jonathan, and Malchishua, and Abinadab, and Eshbaal. And the son of Jonathan was Meribbaal, and Meribbaal begat Micah. And the sons of Micah were Python and Melek and Teriah and Ahaz. And Ahaz begat Jehoada, and Jehoada begat Alameth and Asmaveth and Zimri. And Zimri begat Moza, and Moza begat Binea, Rapha was his son, Eliasa his son, Azel his son. And Azel had six sons whose names are these, as Rikam, Bokaru, and Ishmael, and Sheariah, and Obadiah, and Hanan. All these were the sons of Azel. And the sons of Eshek, his brother, were Ulam, his firstborn, Jehush, the second, and Eliphalet, the third. And the sons of Ulam were mighty men of valor, archers, and had many sons, and sons' sons, and hundred and fifty. All these are of the sons of Benjamin. Chapter 9. So all Israel were reckoned by genealogies, and behold, they were written in the book of the kings of Israel and Judah, who were carried away to Babylon for their transgression. Now the first inhabitants that dwelt in their possessions and their cities were the Israelites, the priests, Levites, and the Nethinims. And in Jerusalem dwelt of the children of Judah, and of the children of Benjamin, and of the children of Ephraim and Manasseh, Uthai, the son of Amahad, the son of Amri, the son of Imri, the son of Bani, of the children of Pharez, the son of Judah. And of the Shilonites, Asiah the firstborn and his sons. And of the sons of Zerah, Jewel and their brethren, six hundred and ninety. And of the sons of Benjamin, Salu the son of Meshullam, the son of Hodaviah, the son of Hasenua, and Ibniah the son of Jeroham, and Elah the son of Uzai, the son of Mikri, 
and Meshullam, the son of Shephathiah, the son of Ruel, the son of Abnijah, and their brethren, according to their generations, nine hundred and fifty and six. All these men were chief of the fathers in the house of their fathers. And of the priests, Jediah and Jehoiarib and Jachin, and Azariah the son of Hilkiah, the son of Meshullam, the son of Zadok, the son of Merioth, the son of Ahitab, the ruler of the house of God, and Adiah the son of Jehoram, the son of Pasher, the son of Malchijah, and Maasiai, the son of Adiel, the son of Jazerah, the son of Meshullam, the son of Meshillamith, the son of Imma, and their brethren, heads of the house of their fathers, a thousand and seven hundred and threescore, very able men for the work of the service of the house of God. And of the Levites, Shemaiah the son of Hashab, the son of Ezraikam, the son of Hashabiah, of the sons of Merari, and Bakbakar, Heresh, and Galal, and Mataniah, the son of Micah, the son of Zikri, the son of Asaph, and Obadiah, the son of Shemaiah, the son of Galal, the son of Jeduthun, and Berechiah, the son of Asa, the son of Elkanah, that dwelt in the villages of the Netophathites. And the porters were Shalom and Akub and Talman and Ahiman and their brethren. Shalom was the chief, who hitherto waited in the king's gate eastward. They were porters in the companies of the children of Levi. And Shalom, the son of Kori, the son of Ebiasaph, the son of Korah, and his brethren of the house of his father, the Korahites, were over the work of the service, keepers of the gates of the tabernacle. And their fathers, being over the host of the Lord, were keepers of the entry. And Phinehas the son of Eleazar was the ruler over them in time past, and the Lord was with him. And Zechariah the son of Meshelamiah was porter of the door of the tabernacle of the congregation. All these which were chosen to be porters in the gates were two hundred and twelve. These were reckoned by their genealogy in their villages, whom David and Samuel the seer did ordain in their set office. So they and their children had the oversight of the gates of the house of the Lord, namely the house of the tabernacle, by wards. In four quarters were the porters, toward the east, west, north, and south. And their brethren, which were in their villages, were to come after seven days from time to time with them. For these Levites, the four chief porters, were in their set office, and were over the chambers and treasuries of the house of God. And they lodged round about the house of God, because the charge was upon them, and the opening thereof every morning pertained to them. And certain of them had the charge of the ministering vessels, that they should bring them in and out by tail. Some of them also were appointed to oversee the vessels and all the instruments of the sanctuary, and the fine flour and the wine and the oil and the frankincense and the spices. And some of the sons of the priests made the ointment of the spices. And Mattathiah, one of the Levites, who was the firstborn of Shalom the Korahite, had the set office over the things that were made in the pans. And other of their brethren, of the sons of the Kohathites, were over the showbread to prepare it every Sabbath. And these are the singers, chief of the fathers of the Levites, who remaining in the chambers were free, for they were employed in that work day and night. These chief fathers of the Levites were chief throughout their generations. These dwelt at Jerusalem. And in Gibeon dwelt the father of Gibeon, Jehiel, whose wife's name was Maacah, and his firstborn son, Abdon, then Zer, and Kish, and Baal, and Ner, and Nadab, and Gedor, and Ahio, and Zechariah, and Mikloth. And Mikloth begat Shimeon, and they also dwelt with their brethren at Jerusalem over against their brethren. And Ner begat Kish, and Kish begat Saul, and Saul begat Jonathan, and Malchishua, and Abinadab, and Eshbaal. And the son of Jonathan was Meribaal, and Meribaal begat Micah. And the sons of Micah were Python, and Melech, and Tarea, and Ahaz. And Ahaz begat Jera, and Jera begat Alameth, and Asmaveth, and Zimri. And Zimri begat Moza. And Moza begat Binea, and Rephiah his son, Eliasa his son, Azel his son. And Azel had six sons whose names are these, Azrikam, Bokaru, and Ishmael, and Sheariah, and Obadiah, and Hanan. These were the sons of Azel.